Ketamine has become a popular and effective drug administered intravenously to treat depression. Now, its chemical relative esketamine has been approved as a treatment that may be even more effective for those struggling to find relief. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration on Tuesday approved the drug for use in a Johnson & Johnson nasal spray called Spravato. It's the first new type of treatment for depression in more than 30 years. Unlike other antidepressants such as Prozac that can take weeks to show an effect, esketamine works much faster, sometimes within just a few hours. Esketamine is a chemical mirror image of the anesthetic ketamine, which is often abused as a recreational party drug known as Special K. Every three to six months, I seem to have a severe depressive episode. Kayla Snyder started battling depression after she left her New Jersey home for college. I didn't know what I was doing in life what my purpose was. I thought something was wrong with me. Snyder says she tried to kill herself three times. Her antidepressants weren't helping, but then she started intravenous ketamine treatment at a New York City clinic. She says it changed her life. I didn't have suicidal thoughts every day, which I used to have, and I just felt like a weight was lifted off my shoulders. We found in our first study of ketamine the patient started feeling better within a few hours. Dr. Dennis Charney has spent two decades studying ketamine. He will get a share of any profits from the spray version. He says the spray takes effect much more quickly than conventional treatments and can be used in lower doses than the intravenous version. But Spravato must be taken in a doctor's office or medical facility, not at home. The spray, which costs around $600 to $900, will carry a black box warning, cautioning the users they may experience experience problems with attention and suicidal thoughts. But for Snyder, she hopes that the benefits will outweigh the risks.